Hey everyone welcome back to the channel. I hope you are doing great. This is a continuation of Cinematic Lux series if you haven't watched the previous video do check them out. In this video I will try to give this whole environment cinematic luck with realistic lighting in simple way possible. I am working in Unreal Engine 4, but this can be done in Unreal Engine 5 without any issue. So first thing first the lighting inspiration for this light work comes from Resident Evil Village. As you can see the lighting in this game is very coldish, and the colors are really pale, that gives us a very dead vibes when we play this game, so let's try to make this scene look like this. You won't believe how easy it will be. First you need to download GPU light mass from this website, or you can get the link in the description. This will help us in building light fast, and will give us realistic output. So step 1 I need to make this scene look real, and in the second step I will do color grading. Let's remove all the existing lights first. As you can see even after removing all the lights the scene still has a lot of baked light, I'll show you how to get rid of it in a moment. But first let's set up the light mass settings. To save more render time I am lowering the num indirect lighting value and indirect lighting quality. I am also lowering the pack light map size as well. And now to remove those already baked light just check on for snow pre-compute. That's it now we can click on build. As you can see we don't have any baked light anymore in the scene, but I still see some extra light which I am removing right away. Before building any light make sure the whole area is covered with light importance volume for better light results. For this kind of scene I am adding a HDRI backdrop for better looking lighting, and we can get the background through it that I downloaded from HDRI heaven. Now switching it to static light and also adding the same HDRI into the skylight cube map. Just before building the light make sure you uncheck the FNP otherwise light will not bake. As you can see we instantly got the good results, but I still need more light inside, so for that I opening the door and changing the skylight intensity and its indirect light intensity.
Let's build again and see the results. Beautiful results just what we needed for the base light for our scene. Now I only need to add a little bit directional light for some directionality and adjust the fog and the background image. Let's color grade it. I am using LUT for it as usually, but we'll create R for this particular scene, so download it from this website and open it in Photoshop. All I need to do is desaturate the colors and some bluish tint to scene once finished I'll drag and drop them onto the color lookup table. Just save it and import it in Unreal. Before using it make sure you change its texture group to color lookup table. And now I can apply it. Here we go we have that kind of vibes going on in our scene. All I need to do is some minor adjustment. Look how beautiful results we have got. That's it for today's video I hope you had fun and learned from it. If you haven't subscribed to the channel do it now and never miss an update. I'll see you all in my next video.